Some good cardio in. Um, I come here way too often, probably four days a week, two hours a day. Um, I'm fully addicted. I have no moderation when it when it comes to golf, but uh, it's a it's a beautiful sport. And uh, let's go let's go smack some balls around. Oh, too deep. One six one with an eight. Come on, say less out here. Uh, this is usually my normal routine. It's about two o'clock. I'll play uh, I'll play golf here from like two to four. Go pick up the babes. Um, but I find this is uh, therapeutic, even though there are certain days where I come home and I'm a straight asshole to my, to my kids and my wife. Um, but I'm in here way too often, five days a week, banging away with my Cobras. Shout out to Cobra, I just got fitted about a, about a month ago. Uh, got the uh, dark speed set here, all black, leather. First day I, I walked in Golf Island with this bag, I was like brushing my shoulders and looking at people and flexing, and thinking I was way too cool. Um, but uh, yeah, the Fowler family t took care of me and hooked me up and actually got fitted at the PGA show uh, in Orlando about a month ago. It was, a, it was a golf and paddle show, first time ever where they've had people all there. So I uh, did some stuff for Skechers and Yola. When I was all said and done, I went over and got fitted for clubs and probably the, uh, uh, the most anxious I felt over that whole weekend was, get, was that 45 minute fitting and I couldn't hit one ball freaking straight. I had the fitting guy from Cobra, nicest guy, his name was Brandon was like sitting down my neck in the nicest way, uh, trying to like adjust my club head and like adjust the uh, weight and all that because I couldn't hit one ball straight. But here, you know, here we are, brand new bag. Been using these clubs now for, uh, yeah, for about a month or two and absolutely love them. And now I'm finally, uh, you know, in a position where I'm playing better golf. Uh, shot my first 80 this last week. Damn near took my pants off, took my shirt off and ran out of here, okay? So only more days like that. <laughs> Doing it up tonight. Uh, usually, anytime we're home, like to have family meals, have our dinner around that table right there. Um, 
a lot of money spent on the road with uh, DoorDash, you know what I mean? Not going to tell you how much, but more than plenty. So anytime we're home, it's groceries. My wife is yelling at me. She's always getting groceries and cooking every night. Uh, and she's been kind enough to be uh, cooking with me in, in the kitchen um, the last couple months. So it's a, it's a family affair. Mommy and Daddy can get after it and, uh, you know, cook up some, some yummy meals. So you called me, right, from when you were... It was a, out at the shark center. It was a code red alert. No. Code red. <laughs> so what'd you ask me? What'd you ask mom? Mama, mama. So you ask me? Oh, you mom. Shy, so. You found a gal at the croc center that you thought was pretty attractive. So okay. what'd you do? What'd you ask her to go do? I don't have that chip. Don't put your hands by that yeah. thing. It's hot. It's hot. So, um, what'd you ask her to go do? For dinner, so cute, right? Mom. And you called mom to have mom Venmo her because she yeah. said she didn't have any money. Yeah, she said, right? Skyler, I'll go to I'll go to dinner with you if what? If you pay. If you pay. Then, right. That's so you didn't have enough money, and so you called me. You said, Mom, can you just Venmo her? Venmo her, okay? okay. Give her the dough. Right? right. So mama, I said no. I said mama, you have money, mama, you can just share it, right? Mama. Right. Five star action. That's how we do it. Feed up the uh, feed up the gremlins. What are you getting, Sky? Scully? What? what are you getting? The shrimp scampi. Shrimp scampi. <laughs> excited. So funny. We uh, we sat down and the the busser was like, "Oh, you're here again." Skylar was just here yesterday. It's a regular, regular, huh? Who'd you come with yesterday? Kevin. Kevin. You and so Kevin is Sky's uh, therapist, and they do community-based therapy. So yesterday he had five hours with them because it's spring break, and so. They always love to go fine dining, right? Where do you, where do you usually go with Kevin? Fine and Olive. Fine and Olive, yeah. This guy knows all the local spots. What's it called? Uh, uh, Miss Honey Peeps, right? Mm -hmm. What is it called? Mrs. Honey Peeps. Mrs. Honey Peeps. And what's the toy store called? Fig Pickles. Fig Pickles. Do they know you in there? Yeah. In both places? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So funny, like we'll, we'll go to like different places in the community, like Home Depot or the grocery store or whatever. And everybody's always like, hey, Sky. Like all these adults that we've never met before, but they all know Skylar. Because depending on the time, we might have to go grab Mackie and Bank. Go pick them up from school. You want to do that? I'll walk around with the shops. Shops. Walk around downtown? Yeah. Well, we'll see what kind of time we have. We got to get Mac and Bank. We're going to take Mackie to the doctor just to check out his cough. Okay. This is how that bad cough is what Mackie said, right? It's a bad cough. Yeah. Um, are you excited to go back to school next week? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, careful. I'm making a mess. <laughs> what are you excited about school? I don't know. No. You like in your new class that you're in? Mm -hmm. Bye, thank you. You know what we could maybe talk Dad into? What? Uh, there's no promises. What? But we could go get Mackie, take Mackie to the doctor. Yeah. Right? Bye. And then after the doctor. Yeah. Maybe we could take the kids to come get dessert. Maybe. We'll see what time. 
see what time he's picking up Thai man. Or maybe we can meet him for dessert. Sound like fun? Yeah. Yeah. Hi! Oh, also. <laughs> Hi! Are you ready? Okay! Oh, there they are! Hi! Hi! Okay! Thank you! Hi! Hi, baby! Thank you so much! Can I see you? Look at it! Who's that? Peter! Hey, did you guys have a good day? Oh, were you eating those banks? Or was Bank Mac? Macker? Can you give that can you give it back to Banks? Thank you. Good job. Come here. Come here with Mama. Whoa, careful. Park. Did you guys have a good day? Yeah? Yeah? Have a good day? Is Daddy in here? No. Daddy went to Spokane. I went to Spokane. You go to Spokane too? Okay, let's take off that big old backpack. Woo. Oh, you all right? We're going to go to the doctor and get your your cough checked out. Look. Look. Yay. You want to go to the doctor? Yeah. Okay, let's go to the doctor. Are you going to sit in this one? Yeah. Okay. All right. You have the purple chair. Did you have a good day? Can sit in the black chair? Yeah, she'll be in the black chair. Did you did you have a good day at school? Yeah. Yeah. Did you have any fun? Oh, I want to go to the doctor. Oh, it's gonna be good. Banks is gonna go with you. I'm hey. gonna with you. Yay! You want Spider Man? Oh, you have Spider Man on. Yeah. I, I broke my hair. You broke your hair. Come to the studio. Your studio. Yeah, go ahead and get yeah. in, Sky. Do you have a good day? <laughs> okay, bright and early here Saturday morning. Uh, about to get some morning pickle touches in with my guy Jace. Uh, Jace is such a stud. He comes to Coeur d'Alene about five days a week, works for Selkirk, and uh, leaves around like 4 or 5 a.m., meets me here around 6. And uh, yeah, he's kind of been my uh, go-to guy for the last six or eight months now. So big, big shout out to Jace. But uh, North Carolina coming up. Uh, this next weekend, fly out tomorrow with the kids. It's Thai spring break here, so yeah. about to go to North Carolina. It seems like every spring break, he's always on a always on a tournament uh, week with the fam. Last couple years, it's been in St. George. So, um, yeah, I've been off the last couple weeks now. Injuries, so I'm better though. And uh, first first day back wasn't all that sharp. You know what I mean? Uh, had to shake off the rust and stuff like that. But I feel like uh, day by day, uh, been getting sharper, feeling. Feel more like myself and uh today's the last day of training in Coeur d'Alene so uh let's have ourselves a good week in North Carolina hey, 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 hey. Get, get back in there sooner yeah yeah I, I think uh I'm pretty comfortable lurking I've spent a lot of time just digging I think for you yeah close up and use these you know use what you got baby use what you got hey uh one zero hey Thanks, buddy. Seven three. Come on, JC. Silly. Silly. Not the move, Ty. Don't watch that. Uh. 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 Get it down. Uh. Yeah, and I think too, just a, a little panic button of yours. Uh. And, and, and I, I see it more in here than I do uh, in uh, skinny, but just like when the score gets a little tighter, you're like running through your third and you're so focused on getting up. So feet are, st I mean, like you hit your best third and like you use your legs, you use your athleticism, you take your time, you don't have to rush, yeah. right? And, and it's like that, that same idea where you're so focused on my fourth before you hit your like initial third, yeah. similar to singles, right? Like yeah. if I get passing in singles on my third, like you're so focused on your return, thinking about my passing shot, 
you end up like missing a return. So. This guy's got some game over there. Just like his daddy, forehand driven. All we breathe and, and smell is forehand city. Big. Up. Jeez, what, what is that? What is that? That's funny. Yeah, if you don't mind. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Come on, train. Pulling out the big boy. Magic. B. A little right. Okay, let's see. Got 106 yards. Try to get under it. Seven iron. Seven iron. Keep your head down. There we go. Look at that. That's one. It's deeper than mine. Stay, 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 stay. Dang. I got my, I got, you I have, yeah, I have, I have some under this. <laughs> okay, here, here. So, is that your pitching wedge? What is that? It's my M, same thing. Okay, hey. But better. I would go, I would go light, because this is, why is this thing so small? I know, <laughs> that's why I'm not using it. Look at this thing. Well, Easter early, we're flying on Easter, bummer, so. Um, mom, Easter Saturday. <laughs> yeah, Easter Saturday. Uh, mom had to help the bunny out, but the bunny came through. He's left footprints all over the ground. Came through the crib. <laughs> this is the crib. The sky's, sky's thinking that the bunny's going to be here. So yeah. I told Sky that the Easter bunny's actually sleeping in his bed right now. No, yeah. So the babies are sleeping right now, and Sky and Ty are... Locked up in, locked in the side house. In the side house. That way they can't uh, <laughs> see what's going on in here or see where we're going to hide their, the eggs. their baskets. So now we're going to go hide in that. Uh, 89. 89 eggs. 89? Why 89? <laughs> Just into how, at, how many there were. Okay. okay. 89 eggs. Uh, the uh, spreading out is going to take place right now. Yeah. House is looking good. I, I actually, she was pissed off at me because <laughs> she told me throughout the week we're going to have Easter on Saturday. Um, but uh, I had scheduled practice this morning and then obviously played some golf afterwards <laughs> and uh, shot some content. Shot some content as well. But yeah, she was a little upset that I wasn't here for this whole process this morning. But as you see, she's done a great job. <laughs> uh, my uh, job after this is cooking Easter dinner. Yep. Uh, she told me last night that Easter should be like Christmas. It should be like an all day thing. Mm -hmm. Little did I know. I didn't know that. <laughs> so uh, so to, to make up for not helping out this morning. I'll be cooking a nice little yummy dinner, and, and yeah, so it's gonna be a good day. All right, it's gonna be hidden. Add a couple in here. This will be our where the courts, the forecourt facility will be, is right back in, in here. So this wow. is our five acres. So you can see the house kind of tucked back. But then, like, way, way back here. Oh, no, you don't want to step on it. it, it what is that? Hey. Yes. Hey. Okay. I think you eat your bunny. What, what kind of paw prints are those? The bunny. It looks like bunny prints. Yeah. If you ask me. Those are very... Are those, are those bono prints? It's a potter. But where are they walking to? What does it lead to? <gasps> Get over there. Head first. 
numbers. Mako. My numbers. Good. You sliding on your booty? <laughs> Show me what I'm working with, buddy. Crunchy? Definitely crunchy. <laughs> Try the crunch. Try some of this. Try some of this. I don't know. There's another pan out there that looks like 10 know. times worse. We <laughs> got Easter baskets, and we went Easter hunting, and I got the golden egg, and then the big egg. And then... What are we doing now right around the table? What, do, what is our tradition around the table? Uh, the best and worst part of the and then... After the Easter hunt, we went and did uh, like paint uh, guns and paint drawing. Not paintball, but yeah. And then we uh, full day. We're doing this. But okay. Well, okay. So, the so paint, what was the best part of your day in the worst? Best part of your day. Destroying guys with the paint guns and the paintballs. Keyword destroy. <sighs> what was the worst part of your day? Waiting. <laughs> waiting an hour, waiting an hour <laughs> for, for what? For you guys to wait, we had to wait in the apartment doing nothing. The Easter Bunny was late. No, what, we, what can we do? Best one of my day. Yeah. Best Seeing the look on my wife's face after this whole thing came together and it was finally complete. Now we're all sitting at the dinner table. Everybody's fed. <laughs> Great day, and I can just see that she is more than proud of you. So, uh, best part of my day. Worst part of my day. Was uh, not making the uh, fairway probably eighty percent of the day. You know, I, uh, I was shooting for the trees today, off, but I, but I did drive. get a W on uh, on my drive. Yeah. What was the best part of your day? The paint guns. The, the paint, paint guns. You like I, that? I hit him really hard in the forehead. Did you like the guns or the both. paint balls both. better? Both. Which one? Like, both. if you could pick one, which one would you both. pick? Both. Or you pick them both? Yeah. For sure. Mm -hmm. No matter what. <laughs> what color? What was your favorite color? Probably all of them. All of them. <laughs> <laughs> you know, just likes it all. Right. Okay, what was the worst part of your day? Waiting for guys for an hour. <laughs> we waited for like an hour. Same. 25 minutes. It was a long time. Was it worth the wait? That's what I want to know. Yeah. There? It was no. worth it? Now, where are you guys going? Uh, we were just talking and I was, yeah, I was 
We're talking about what? <laughs> train. Oh. Train. Worst part of my day is getting up, man. It's just, I, he's, he's not a up. morning guy, man. He's not a morning guy. I know that. Sitting there, it's like, oh, it's not even that early. Like, that's, that's what kills me, man. Right? Like, uh, we gotta get this circadian not morning guy. figured out. Yeah. <laughs> the best part, I really like the shots that the the color wars. That sun coming through the trees, keeping my distance. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> keeping the camera it, safe. Yeah, but it was really fun. <laughs> Thank you first. No, I didn't get hit, hit but, but it looked really cool and it looked fun. And I was you having, did get hit, yeah. And I was having fun too. The worst part of my day was slaving over those potatoes. Mm -hmm. Just oh. have them get super crispy oh. and black on the grill. Mm. Dang it. It's stunk. It's stunk. Um, the best part of my day was, I think. I think seeing the Easter Bunny come and all the fun stuff. Okay. All in all, I think that we should do another paint thing tomorrow in the morning. All right, we signing off. Signing off. All right. Bye bye. Bye bye. Where are we at, this? The airport. We're at the airport. What airport? Do you know? Can you say Minneapolis? Yeah. Say mini. Minneapolis. That good thing is funny. Yeah, we <laughs> anchor. They do.